Hello and welcome back to my Minecraft Survival Let's Play series. And this time it's running 1.13. Oh yes, I have updated the world as well as the textures. Now I just want to say this is the new Minecraft textures. I will leave a link for the Minecraft wiki where you can find um, a download link for these new Minecraft textures. It is not a part of Minecraft 1.13. I just downloaded them and I thought it would be a, um, a great time maybe to update them as well and like bring something extra new, right? So yeah, I have done that and also upgraded or updated the world to 1.13. And um, yeah, I think everything should be working very well. Also, we can see the texture changes as well, which I really do like, I must say. Um, there's a creeper there. Oh dear. Let's just run past him. Now, there are some textures that are not changed. Um, whoa, lag. Anyways, oh yes, look at the weed. Looks amazing. All right. Okay, so I'm just gonna sleep. And what we are going to be doing today is Oh yes, we found this enchanted golden apple in the last episode down in the mineshaft. But today, also the melon seeds and pumpkin seeds. But in this episode, we're going to explore that ravine we found, which is going to be really exciting. So I'll meet you down there at, um, at the ravine because I just have to find it first. So stay tuned. Now, of course, because this is Minecraft 1.13, I just had to see the ocean. Now, of course, whoa. <laughs> now, of course, um, the water has changed and this is 1.12 um, 1 generated ocean. So we won't have all those nice plants and stuff, but I see a dolphin. Let's go down here. Hi, they with some gunpowder, I guess, maybe. Don't know if they do that. Oh yes, it does. <laughs> That's so cool. That is so cool. I need some air. This is amazing. And look at me swimming as well. That's great. And the way you need to actually stay up to get air, that's amazing as well. And we also have a fish here. Nice. And we also have a fish pack over here. This is awesome. I don't know how it works then when you use fishing rods. I don't know. But, um, whoa, did it just give me a boost? Yeah, I think it gave me a boost. <laughs> Hi. Oh, man, they're cute. Listen to them as well. All right. We'll have to explore the ocean another time because I want to go down in that ravine and see maybe we got some diamonds or something down there. So, um, yeah, I'll meet you at the ravine. Also, look at the crops. They actually look really good as well. This is amazing, this um, texture pack update. It has been there for quite a while, way before 1.13 got released. Um, but yeah, this is now an official 1.13 Minecraft Survival Vanilla Let's Play. So, that's great. So, let me find the ravine and I'll be with you in just a sec. Stay tuned. Oh yeah, clicking all the wrong buttons. Great. All right, where is it again? All right. I found it. I see Laps Lazuli and I see an Enderman over there. I see a zombie and I also see redstone, but I also see some real. Oh, is that? No, that's gold. Okay. I want the gold. So let's just jump right down. There's a creepy spider there. I don't know if that text just got changed. But they did. They definitely did. Okay. The ores go. Whoa. <laughs> oh, wow. I heard footsteps and then I was like, oh no. Oh, don't blow up, please. Okay, there we go. Oh, another spider. I think they're actually below. Let, let's just make sure that the coast is clear. Okay, there's a skeleton here. And another spider. Nice. Shoot this spider instead of me. There we go. I should probably have my shield equipped here, shouldn't I? Yeah, I should. Whoa, two skeletons. Okay, let's just get these guys real quick here. Okay, there's another spider here. There are more mine shaft here, as you can see, apparently. So, do you see that cobblestone? 
Oh wait, I've been here. Okay, I wait, I've been here. Hold up. This is the place there were like three creepers in the last episode, and I decided not to um, not to go down there. But this actually re reads leads to the ravine. Oh, okay. I can well remove that cobblestone if I ever need to, but I won't do it now. Okay, so we got a bit of iron here. I'll take it. I'll take it. Nice. Okay, so getting back to the um, ravine here. Seems like there might be some more cave activity down there. There's some water here. I'm just going to dig around it. Here we go. I see some. Okay, I thought it was cobweb, but it's not. I wonder if there's any like diamonds down here, but I guess we need to go down and see for ourselves. Um, that was fun. <laughs> okay, let's just see if there's anything in this part of the mine shaft. Okay, nothing there. Maybe we could find another mine card with chest or something, right? Okay. Okay, that's just a dead end. Oh, we got some gold. Minecart with chest. What did I say? All right, let's get some design here. Now, this will be a ravine exploration, not a mine shift, but I do want some of these resources. Okay. All right, whoops. Let's put it back on track, <laughs> literally. Okay, let's see what it got. And uh, not much. It got some bread and melon seeds and powered rails, which is actually pretty good because they are a bit expensive. But we did get a name tag, which is pretty good. Um, all right. Apparently, it does not remember my... Uh, does it? Oh, it does. Okay. It just this. It's like... Yeah. It's kind of like broken. It doesn't remember that I have done that already. Oh. Hello. Okay, let me just get this gold and I'll be right back out in the ravine and uh, yeah, see you in a bit. Just want to see what's down here. Well, it would appear that I have found actually two more minecarts with chests down here. So let's open it up right here. Okay, we got some coal, some rail and protection one book and eh, not great, but not the worst either. And then on the other side of here, um, okay, I don't have a shovel. We'll go around. I think this one is full as well. Just because it's very dark here. And does it seem like I've been here? And yeah, let's see what it is. Another golden apple. That's just a normal golden apple, but it's still a golden apple, which is pretty good. And a bunch of real as well. Okay, okay, with that done, let's now hit back to the ravine and my inventory is already full so you know what uh, no I want to keep those there for memory purposes I was going to smack one of them and that's a slime huh interesting I was going to smack one of those minecarts and get the chest but I'm just gonna make a crafting table and craft the chest no big deal uh, okay dark alley dark alley I'm not gonna go down them okay let's see um, I don't think, well, only one way to find out, really. Okay. Uh, and, nice. Perfect hit. <laughs> okay, we got a cave here. Let's just check it out. What Y level are we at? We are at 16. Pretty sure diamonds only spawn at 15 and below. So, we most likely won't find any diamonds here because the ravine is... Not high enough, but maybe in this cave, if it goes deep enough. We got some more gold, which is pretty good. Not bad. We can use the gold for stuff. I don't find a great many usages for gold, but it's there. Okay, we got some redstone here, which I do want to pick up, actually. So, grab that. We got some lapis lazuli, which I highly want. Highly want. Uh, greatly, great, wait. How do you say it? Which I want a lot. <laughs> there we go. Um, I see some more redstone down there. I don't think this is part of the ravine, actually. Let's 
let's just expand that a bit. I don't want to kill the natural light, but it's really the easiest way to get down here. I, s I don't see, but I hear it's going, which ain't good for my health. <laughs> okay. Especially not so close to lava. Okay, so this did lead down to the ravine again. Um, okay, no big deal. Let's get the iron. We can't have too much iron. Okay, uh, how do we get out of here? Okay, so here is the lapis lazuli we saw. Just one. We got some redstone, not bad. We will need all this redstone eventually, because I do want to make stuff. So it'll do us good in the future. Um, just drop that. Clear my inventory. Let's see what's... Oh, bad guys. Let's see what's down here. Alright. Get this iron. So skeletons apparently got changed the way they look as well. How did he hit that? I was blocking my shield. Take that. Whoa. Is there another one here? Um, I don't know. Don't hit the bat. He didn't do anything. Wow. Evil skeletons. Okay. Give me your XP. What is this water doing? Oh. It got through, apparently. So lava was here at some point. Whoa, I need that cobblestone. No. Give me that cobblestone. <laughs> okay. So there's... Eh. Lava here, apparently. Okay, just try and block it. Items also apparently float on top of water now, which is actually pretty cool. So if you were in an ocean and you dumped some stuff, it would go down to the bottom of the ocean. But now it floats. I don't know if that goes for all items or not, but many of them actually... Um, I think they do, most most of them, if not all, I'm pretty sure they all do, but again, I don't know exactly if there are some that don't go down, or float, rather. <laughs> oh, another skeleton, okay. Get down there, that's right, burn. Okay, let's go back this way, and let me just grab that iron right here. Let me know, by the way, if you like to see me mine, or if you would rather have that part cut out, because I guess it can be a bit boring, but also... Oh! Okay. That's why you go down from one end to another. Okay. Um, yeah. I know some people think that mining might be boring, some might really like watching it, so let me know your opinion. Would you like to see more of me mining or would you rather have it cut out? Let me know, just because I'm curious. <laughs> so yeah, that's a thing you can write down in the comments. Okay, so we are now going actually from a cave or from, from a ravine to a cave, which is actually bright, pretty interesting. So if we just go, okay, so that's gravel. If we go back here, this is the... Okay, I thought actually the cave, it went from a cave into a ravine, but it actually didn't. Okay, my bad. Well, that's a trap. This cave is actually pretty interesting. Plenty of resources, not diamonds though, but um, there's stuff. Okay, so that's where we looked at the ravine. Let's finish this. Actually, I just want to see what's up here real quick. Maybe some more gold or something. Okay, just spiders and zombies. You know what? I'm just going to leave them be. I'm not going, even going to bother with them. All right. I'm going to go back to the ravine. Okay, let's go um, from one end to another and make sure that we covered everything. So just, whoa, a little bit of lag. Okay, more redstone. I missed that. There we go. Nice. It also gives quite a lot of XP. Not much, but it gives a little bit. Not much on the sides of the ravine, actually. Maybe some iron and coal here and there. 
like there. Um, but as I've said in previous episodes, if I go past iron and all of that stuff like that, it's not because I, well, sometimes maybe I don't see it, but I sometimes do it on purpose if I just don't want to use time on mining all of it, right? Like I don't want to do that now, I just mainly want to explore and get some of it. And then I'll come back at some point when I need more iron, then I know exactly where to come to and I don't have to um, go find a whole new place to mine. So that's just how I like to do things. So for example, here I leave some iron and all of a sudden I need iron. Then I'm like, oh, wait a second, there was that ravine. I left a bunch of iron down there. Let me go and get it. So that's kind of how that works, I guess. All right. Um, I think that's actually pretty much the entire ravine. Not much, um, no diamonds or anything. They could spawn here at lower down like there, but they didn't so <laughs> of course there might be whoa I just hit that that's not nice um, of course there might be some hidden like in the walls but since I can't see through the walls then yeah I don't know if there are or not also there are definitely more mine shaft most likely to be explored more levels and stuff but I'm just gonna leave it as is and maybe we'll explore it at a later date uh, it's just a dead end okay so we are just exploring some caves now actually um, okay I've been here uh, okay I would actually like to go down that deep hole we found so if I go back to that and drop down let's see what's down there all right this can either be a great adventure or uh, eh. It did end. I have no idea. And did end. No great adventure for us. <laughs> oh well. It was worth a look. Uh, let me get back up. Oh no, I'm stuck. Eh. Okay. Here we go. Complicated, but not complicated enough. Okay, so what did we get for that? We got a bunch of redstone, we got gold, we got almost a stack of iron, and even more if I um, if I had mined more. Um, we've also found another gold maple in the minecart chest. We actually found, I think, three in total, which actually ain't that bad. Um, yeah, not too bad at all. There's something back here, don't know what. Just another cave, apparently. With a dead end. Of course. Alright. I think I'm actually done with this place. For now, anyway. Um, we've been at the ravine. We've been in the mine shaft. We have... Yeah. I think I'm done. At, for this... Pl at, at, uh, at this place, anyway. Um, yeah. We can come back here. At some point, if we ever feel like it or need to, if we need some resources, we know there are plenty in the mine shaft and also a bit in the ravine on the walls, like up there and there. Um, so yeah, not too bad of a trip. I'll head back to the village now, and well, I have to pick up all my loot, and that is gonna take a while because I most likely can't carry it all. Now, sadly. I did not find a set a saddle in any chest or anything, which well I kinda wish I had found that because then I could tame a donkey and use that to transport stuff, but I know there are llamas as well and I could make a caravan, but we'll see how much stuff I actually have and now I just gotta find my way back here. I'm pretty sure it's this way. Um Somewhere around here. Yes, right here. And then it's either turning to nighttime or turning to daytime. Oh, creeper. It's just uh let's just leave him be in his cave. I think it's actually turning to daytime. Let's see. Poke our head out. Um yeah, the sun is coming up. Perfect timing. Alright. Let me just see how much we actually got from this long trip down in the mine shaft and in the ravine. Hey, 
Do I have enough front flash here? No, I don't. Okay, let me just put everything in here and we'll see how much stuff we got. Um, that was 27 coal I got there. All right. Not bad. Put this here. Actually put the uh, cobblestone here. Okay. So from that we got a little bit of coal I think. Some wood. Plenty of gold ore. Plenty of iron ore as well. Two diamonds. A bunch of rail. String. An enchanted golden apple. And two enchanted books. Three normal golden apples. Didn't we get more gold than that? Huh. That's strange. Well then, I thought we had gotten more gold, but I'm pretty sure I took everything I found when it came to gold. Anyways, I'm going to call it an episode right here. So in the next episode, we will either start with transporting all this stuff back, or I will start the episode and I already have done it. So yeah, we'll, um, we'll see how we'll start the next episode. But I hope you enjoyed, and if you did, remember to leave a like. Comment and share it with your friends and if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe. And again, this is now a world in 1.13, so we will definitely have to check out all the features of Minecraft 1.13. I don't I'm pretty sure I don't even know them all, so it's going to be a great adventure. Anyways, hope you enjoyed and have a nice day. Bye bye.